All right. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to uh, Mario Kart Tour World Cup. Um, we have it in finals today. Finally, after a long, long journey, we finally at the end. Um, we have in two uh, the, the best two teams of the tournament fight for the gold, all in right now. And uh, let me let me tell you, I'm very excited to see how this goes on because um, I have I, I have some like my predictions didn't quite made it to this point. Uh, <laughs> Some bushel moments there, but um, yeah, we've seen some great stuff today. Yeah, I guess we should introduce ourselves first, though, right? So, um, I'm T or Liddy, and we have Sam yeah, as well. Yeah, hello everyone. <laughs> you may know me. Um, so yeah, um, what are you expecting for this match, T? Um, I'm actually expecting. Well, I'm a bit biased since I am from the United States, but um, I actually do expect to see a very interesting match, um, especially from Japan's side to see if they're going to bag or not. I'm personally predicting, you know, a little bit biased, but I'm personally predicting a very close 2-1 for the United States. Oh, all right. Yeah, so yeah, that, that, what you say is interesting. Um, on this game, for the ones who don't know, um, there is a tendency uh, for all teams to have one bagger and three runners, because uh, as same as MK we, um, you the shock. Uh, I mean, the items are determined by your uh, position and not by distance. So uh, there's always you want always to get that box in eighth place to try to get the shock. Uh, but unlike uh, most of the teams uh, in this tournament and in general, uh, Japan teams. Uh, don't usually have a hard bagger. Uh, they prefer uh, right. to play like in the middle, getting some dodges. And if the shock is used by the other team, having one or two dodges just to ensure uh, the top positions. But um, they showed something different uh, last week as they fought uh, the best uh, smuggler in the world. Uh, they actually had someone to counter it, and it worked really well on the first match. So. Right. Uh, as uh, USA has an incredible back here, uh, Samuel here, um, I don't know yeah. if they will be using the same strat here or will they all run? I'm I'm expecting to see. Well, some... we can look at the lineups real quick. Uh, yeah. We have, I mean, what is, we have probably, you know, are you like, an arguably the best lineup for the United States Super FX, uh, NH Speedy, Calm Trees, and Samuel right there. Samuel being the bagger. And NH Speedy gonna be the guy and Super FX gonna be the guys in the front and Comptries is a very good catch up player, so we'll see how they work. As we are getting into it, we will be getting into Japan's lineup after the first race. But we are gonna be looking at I believe this is baseball club, if I'm not mistaken. Uh um, no, I think this is a Wendy. I think we'll be seeing Mashiron today. Oh Mashiron? Okay, yeah. I just saw the bottom right there. But yeah. Uh I do actually have the tracks. Uh this is um this is actually the new track. Yeah. LA Laps. Our RT right here, and this one's notorious for the respawn, right, Sanch? Yeah, for sure. Um, this track, actually, I, I believe this track, uh, uh, like, um, unless all the other variants, uh, this track is the like less front run heavy because of the respawns here and the shortcut uh, at the beginning of the track. Uh, if you are in the mid pack, uh, it's easy to catch uh, into the first uh, players, but uh, if you have a bit of a lead, then you're a bit, you're just gone. So. Um, I think yeah, someone you see, see really one three for Japan, which is really good. They had Speedy does have the shrimp, so he will respawn and yeah, he will respawn. Um, uh, I'm not, up not to respawn actually, that's a good play, but uh, let's see if he can. Oh, that ooh, bomb, yes, oh, yeah. and that's a nice snipe, yeah. What, top, top, two. top two, and uh, yeah. he just needs to chain uh, this these protections. Um, maybe he will attempt a backspam here. Okay. It's a really good spot to backspam, but uh, with one protection, I will, don't know if he will try it. I do think USA is all in A, so there could be a potential shock in play, but these items and are really good. And something to note as well gliders are actually really, really not that. Or if you shock on the glider, it's not really that good. So if there's shock that comes out right now, it's not going to affect uh, Japan that much. And we see a top four already for uh, Japan. And oh, we do see the shock coming out. And we see, I think, two USA dolphins right there? Yeah, uh, yeah. yeah, and he gets pushed out. 
Oh, yeah, this is bad for Machiron, but um, this is a close race uh, if they manage to... Oh, he, a baseball club actually maintaining first there and getting first. Oh, yeah. So, um... Oh, 2 three, yeah. five, six though, for the United States, and... Still a winning uh, race for USA. That's a plus three for them, but... Um, I mean, you can't stop baseball club on his track, you know? So <laughs> yeah, first. you're right. We so, do have the uh, beam uh, combination right there. Uh, who will win baseball, the baseball track, or uh, the, the Americans on the LA on the LA course? But uh, LA tour. But we do have Japan's starting lineup. Yeah. Uh, again, Jibacha. star started Jibacha Baseball Club, Meshuriyan, Haruru. Um, you can talk more about it, Sanch, but yeah, yeah, this um, is they're, the they're defending champs. Yeah, the defending champs. Uh, their MVP is not playing right now, but uh, the, all of these four members are just monsters of the game. I think uh, Kaguya is working right now, so he will miss these uh, finals. But I do believe this team is more than enough to uh, just yeah. defend. I heard he's uh, traveling, uh, so yeah, oh, yeah, that's what I heard from Mugi Chan. But yeah, yeah, yeah. we are going to. Um, I think this is Cheap Cheap Island, if I'm not mistaken. Cheap Cheap Island R, if I'm not yeah. mistaken. Yeah, yeah, okay. And uh, yeah, Chief Chief Island are very, very notorious actually comeback track in my opinion because of the huge cuts at the end, but otherwise very, very... Um, red. Yeah, that red is unfortunate right there. That's a top three for uh, Japan and Samuel in the back. Uh, yeah. A bit of top uh, moment for Japan to catch, I think. We do see them dropping, so there is going to be a bagging battle there, but Samuel's doing a good job staying in last for now. And we see a top three. Oh, do you see a blue shell though coming in from? Oh, bomb. oh he didn't use the bomb. Yeah, this is probably going to end Mushroom's race right here, unless there's a shot in play. But uh, this blue will cause a bit of a damage if they're not able yep. to dodge. And he does use the blue right there, and it will. Hit it. And he gets a heart, which is actually really good. Even if uh, USA gets shocked, he can dodge everything because uh, yeah. that heart does last a very, very long time. Yeah, they, and he they... gets a really good play there. Mega? Yeah. Wow. It's still hard. Oh, 2 3 right now for Japan. Maybe they can red the game first. It'll Maybe we'll see the mini map. No. Oh, actually, he... Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, okay, yeah. So that's only a second place for Japan. Yeah. Um, great job for USA, uh, as we say in that track. Um, having the top spots early on, managed. Uh, they managed to just uh, maintain them. Uh, the top three, at least for the first lap, and then just. Haru getting that second place, and the rest of USA still in the top spots. So, I actually have a question. Do you consider this more of a front-running track? Because I always consider this more of a bagging track, because in you can catch up easily with those no. two shortcuts, but I feel like in a war setting, it's kind of different, correct? Yeah, in a war, it's kind of different, because, um, like, you can, you can like, shroom into uh, a bit of top spots, but it's hard, like, if you're having a, already a top two, even a top three, is, uh, it's much harder to just come back, like, the only thing, uh, like, you can say a bit of uh, advantage to the guys who are in the front is like a Mega in 4th place or a Star in 4th place uh, to break in the last circuit, but otherwise it, it's a good running track, I'd say. And we see right. a great running track again, now Maple Freeway uh, T version, uh, the track that doomed Mexico uh, last week. <laughs> I know, you're very, I know you're a huge Mexico fan and you're very upset about that, but, uh, you know. It happens, bro. They had a really, really close match, like here, uh, Japan did with Mexico, and hopefully the same for the, the United States and Japan, as we are starting in sixth place for Mashiron. And uh, he's he's in interesting spots. He actually might snipe people out here, and we see Calm actually getting hit out there. Oh no, I think it was just like in last place actually, trying bagging for the shock actually. Um, but um. Early first for Japan. Maybe it's not the best as uh, yeah, he gets automatically read it there. Right. Early top two now for uh, USA, but I don't know if they have shrooms uh, to take that respawn. They probably don't, so um, let's see if this will last longer. Like, the guy in third doesn't have any reds because he was first, I think. Yeah, so, uh, he actually, I we see Mushroom actually in second place right now. Yeah. And um, yeah, he's gonna take this respawn strat right here. Okay. 
He's going for the respawn, um, actually, without a shroom. I think that's a bit slower, in my opinion, but uh, I'm not very sure. I think I saw a lot of people uh, taking it, so I think it doesn't really matter too much. But this is a really good position for Mushroom right here. That's he has right. that heart. Yeah, and he's going to chain it right there. So he, if Shock does come, he will probably dodge it. Blooper comes in. Oh, but that blooper. One of the hearts is okay. Uh, but Mushroom going to keep this Mushroom in... Uh, in third place, you could actually lead him into the first place if he's not uh, hit. But, yeah, but uh, it's, it's sticking out. And we see nice. super effects in the heart, too. And calm. Maybe he wants to use this mushroom just to red someone out. It, it could be a good play, but uh, they're really close. So, uh, this mushroom, I think Haru has a mushroom in second place, so he will be taking first place if nothing happens here. Um, but yeah, I, I don't know if a mushroom will hold yeah. in third place. It's gonna be really we close. Yeah, he can turn it out! I had a, I, I had a feeling oh, about that. Uh, Haru's yeah. gonna take that place. Maybe uh, he's fighting. No, no, he doesn't. Maybe. Yeah, no, he doesn't. And he actually gets hit at the early end. Oh. How great would you say? Yeah. And that's some... Oh my god. That's a dangerous gambit that uh, Mushroom and... Who was the person in the second? Haru? Yeah, Haru. Uh, yeah. He, he's they might off. have... Yeah. I, I know what happened. Like, Speedy... Maybe he got two reds in, like, he called it the, those red shells. No, there's no way. Uh, maybe he got sniped. That, yeah, that's maybe. I think about, because, um, yeah, Speedy only had at least one red, uh, but Haru at least had one protection because he has second place. So, um, right? Great stuff for, um, great stuff for USA, actually. Top three right now is going to be huge, uh, and all they have to do now is just maintaining the lead. Yeah, it's a 68 to 49 lead for the United States. Kind of surprising. I actually expected it to be a lot, uh, a lot more back and forth between the teams. But USA just, I think they're just, I don't want to say that they're just like making these plays that like, just like they're just making great snipes, as you said at the beginning. And that also that was a really good red play from. I think they have a super FX who uh, redded Mushroom out. To in first place, as we are switching to uh, Super FX's uh, POV right there. Yeah. But yeah. yeah uh, um, USA is doing ooh. a great job into, uh, getting into but, that spots, and Samuel being in the back just uh, complicates a bit Japan. Yeah. So I'd say, we are, we yeah. are, though, I want to mention this. We are in uh, Rainbow Road, which is, I noticed that um, is him. a very good Japan, very strong Japan track, actually. Um, from what I've uh, heard, okay, when this track gets big, this is gonna be very hard for us. So let's see how they capitalize. Two, one, three, two, three from the United States. Right oh, there. nice red. Ooh, there, nice top, red, yeah. Yeah, top, t oh, top three right there and a heart. And a heart, but for he does him. draw. He should be, he should be good if he uh, changes correctly. But um, yeah, I I was about to say that uh, this could be a great track for all Japan members to run and try to dodge. Right. Uh, this rap is going to be really great as there will still be a top three right now. This star could do a bit of damage, but uh, it might be maybe it won't do because they're a bit behind. Yeah. Uh, and, oh yeah. my goodness! It I don't see Japan crazy. catching up. Yeah. Oh, oh do you see baseball club? Of getting course, baseball club. <laughs> <laughs> baseball club getting a bill in I believe seventh or sixth and billing up to get first. You know, you'll get that from him. He's very close in those situations, and, but unfortunately. Point. It was going to be really huge for uh, USA. This track is just so great at front running. Like if you get hit one time, then you're all, you race is over unless uh, you right. go up in seventh place and just activate it at the end. But yeah, still, we're not really yes, uh, you are correct. They're getting the great races and they're getting the momentum. So, um, I think Japan, uh, they they need to do what they are they know to do. Like you can't you can't be bagging at. Uh, like, I think USA is benefiting a lot uh, having one uh, left Japan member in the front, I think. Uh, just doing all this work, getting the top spots real quick. Uh, with, oh yeah, so Babel Club will die again on this track, so... Um, I don't know how this will end for uh, Japan. So far so good, uh, USA doing a great job. And they're in the lead, so let's see what happens in this track. Yeah. yeah. And she doesn't see Japan back, but sending baseball club is very, very interesting. Consider one of the best like online players. But I mean yeah. you can't go wrong because you know everyone in Japan is very are very, very strong at running. But uh we do see um a kind of a dominating beginning for Japan right here. 
Yeah, I already top here. Uh, there's a Wendy with a red shell. They have to be careful. Yeah. So activating that heart there uh, will ensure that uh, if the red shell, even if the red shell duplicates, um, that won't nothing will happen to FX. As we see right now, to mash run into oh, Ooh, this he gets red. Oh, bro. Yeah, this this pack play uh, leading USA into the top spots really early. Uh, but we see baseball club in last. So yeah, he just got into last. So it, there's a box actually coming up right now. So if he gets it, he could just oh. use this don't He can just oh, dodge his yeah. teammates right here. Japan are in too hard, so this could be huge for Japan if Baseball Club does get shot. It's not looking good. This will be a solid race for uh, USA, I think, yeah. There, there's nothing, nothing in play right now, not even a blue shell. And Japan members are just not getting an answer as... Uh, oh, and the red! Red, it's, it's another top three! Oh my god, USA going wild into the Japan on this first half of the GP. And they are just getting no response. Like, I think bagging is not the solution. You need baseball club in the front just to do some work because these these reds are just crazy for you to say. They're just getting it in all spots. Like th that red from Com, like in fifth place, just denied Mashiron from anything. And that red at the end, just amazing. Like I think that was a mistake though. You, you're streaming into second place, uh, but the guy in third, of course, you have a red, at least one. But yeah, the Japan. I don't know, yeah, Baseball Club even bagging uh, two races right now, I think, and he's uh, like at the top of the points of on his team, so they may be one Yeah, <laughs> that isn't, if you're bagging and you're still on top of the points, that's very, very worrisome if yeah. you're Japan right here, but we are going to Airship Fortress T, a very, very huge front rank track, so this actually may be a good chance for Japan to catch up here. But uh, yeah, USA's I item play, I just want to mention, USA's item play has been ridiculous. Yeah, those reds are just too powerful, man. And Baseball Club will still back, so they're still confident about their running skills. But uh, this turn, uh, in particular, this turn is a bit, uh, a lot laggy, like one of the laggiest turns on the uh, on the tour right now. Uh, someone can easily get spammed here and just not recover at all, um, which is not the case of. Right. Oh, yeah. Ooh, but FX right does get trailed right there, as you mentioned, yeah. very hard. And this is a huge front running track, so it's very hard to catch up. Yeah, but still, um, at least we're having four sets of boxes, so even a shock it will be a bit more common. But as uh, we see, FX with a star in six, uh, with, with all these dash panels, uh, the star is not going to do a bit, a lot, a lot uh, to coming back. And um, like having a mushroom or a star in this turn is like it's actually the worst. As um, it's really hard to like get a good alive. This red is actually going to end FX race right here, but. Um, and in the top, we see a 2-3 coming up, uh, one That's Japan awesome. member actually in second place. First and place. he has a star too. Oh, his star will do a lot of damage. Uh, Jibacha has to go wide here, uh, just to not get hit. And uh, I think Speedy got taken out. And right now, top 2-4 uh, for Japan. In, in and oh, the banana. banana. Nice avoid there. Uh, yeah. I was going to say, baseball in last place. So, we'll be seeing a shock maybe for USA. Maybe in seventh place. Is that that's what they need right now? As Japan is now now in top three. Um, yeah, this is key right here. The mega is being used early. There is a shock. A shock. What happened with that shock? Like, okay, someone maybe someone dodged in the front. Oh no, they didn't. No, no they one didn't. dodged actually. Oh, I was getting up there. We did mega. Yeah, uh, he should be getting first place here. Yeah. Are you scored? This is oh second. Oh, second place, and it's a winning race for Japan, but just a bit. Uh, this shock is, uh, is was like he denied that uh, plus eleven for Japan and just converted it into a plus one. Yeah. And only very... Haru or uh, or Jibacha get into that first place. Yeah, I'm, I'm surprised. Very, very, very good damage control. But something I noticed, I think Speedy and Calm got. I think they. One of them got TS'd, I think, because oh, yeah, of the yeah, shock yeah. right there. I, I, I saw one. I saw someone respawning, but um, that yeah, that's a nice shock. I'm not sure because I, I what I saw was baseball in last uh, at the moment of the top three. So maybe Samuel got it uh, a bit before uh, in last place because I think he was in last place. But if not, that wasn't the case, that shock in seventh place was the best play, uh, the best thing that could happen to them, as. Um, Right now, we're seeing a massive lead, uh, massive lead uh, for United States. 
someone something that um, some of you may not expect. But uh, in this in this game, all, all things can happen. And uh, having this is not actually is not that uh, strange. Uh, seeing how like USA played on the first half is just amazing. It's, they, it's more than deserved that lead. But uh, they have to maintain it. And I think on this track, um, all members will run, yeah, exactly. And uh, Japan will yeah. love to try to dodge this track because uh, this track is great at, uh, like, shock, shock heavy uh, because of that shock at the end. So if you can manage to take stars or mega uh, into that last turn, then just gone. Um, but we see a kind of a mix. Mixed position. Yeah, now. mixed spots right now. Two, three, four now for the United States. This shortcut's gonna be really, really big. I can think... take a box, right? And take it? Yep, he will. Yeah. Yeah. And I think uh, got Japan got hit out, so it's top three. I don't know if top three is gonna be good in this situation, though, because this is a huge catch up track, especially these shortcuts right here. You'll see Mushroom Run take a shortcut. Or, no, he's opting to hold it. Oh, no, he is gonna use his Mushroom right there. And, this, ooh, that's a really nice line. Uh, this is not the best for. Uh... For USA, but uh, I I think the pack is, the pack is not actually that uh, spread out as um, yeah maybe maybe this top two will maintain at least the first place. This bomb actually oh. denied if they got tighter line, but uh, yeah, last shot in the shock. And that's a top that, two. The top two, top bottom two, two. That's a really good shock still. Two win race for USA. That shock was just a very 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 uh, clutch moment. I think Samuel got it and. Uh, the, that speedy and FX dodging there, just amazing stuff. Like, the, the, that's a winning race for USA, and that's all they need. They just need winning races, just not big losses, and they will be fine for the first game. Yeah, and I want to say that I'm very surprised with, like, what's going on. USA just kept keeping on, like, getting winning race after winning race, and... Some of them being dominant, some of them are like, eh, they're like a little margin, but like, it's really interesting to see. Japan actually had a really good shot of winning that race, but the shock again, coming up and clutch, Samuel doing a really good job in getting those shocks. And you see the issue with when you don't bag is that, you know, <laughs> a lot more shocks are happening. We didn't see a lot of shocks in the previous matches, but because uh, J what USA is doing is just, just staying in eighth and keeping up with the pack. So there's going to be more boxes that are going to be uh, hit, therefore more chances of shot. As we are going to Los Angeles Laps R, and ooh, this is really good, a top four for um, Japan at the beginning of this draft. Yeah, but this is not going to last, uh, I think, because uh, all of these fans... Oh my god. Of course. Classic... <laughs> <laughs> but but uh, I actually want to point, uh, Japan gave up on the bagging, at least on this track. It's red actually going to connect on someone. I think baseball gets spawned at the back. And uh, so that did a, a Japan member, actually. Two, two Japan members yeah. on the back is going to be really tough for them to hold this, I'd say. Uh, but um, they actually didn't give up on bagging as baseball club failed again. Oh, what a red! Oh, this red is going to be huge! Super um, drafted into second and redded the guy. Oh my goodness. Got some great... And he trails him, I think, so it's top three right now. Yeah, Oh, that was a nice avoidance, too. Yeah, Jibacha, um, oh, yeah, 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 so... Pity didn't, didn't want to use his shroom, but the, Ooh, this is going right. to be great for uh, Japan and uh, mitigating some damage, but... Oh, the blue! The oh blue my god, Kong got blue, Kong got blue. Yeah, Comtris got absolutely wrecked there, and he yeah, will not be able to recover. Uh, but uh, if Speedy can maintain the first place, it's going to be good for them, but 2-3-4 uh, for Japan. I don't I know. Speedy gets hit out. Oh no, no, he doesn't. No, he didn't. Speedy actually saving USA on this race, and just a minus one is not enough for Japan to capitalize on this track. And um, yeah, baseball getting hit there just nullifies his race. I think he decided to back after he got hit. Uh, yeah. But um, now, clever reaction from uh, Samuel dropping too, uh, which led to baseball club again dropping. But uh, he had all the losing, like losing. Bots there, so uh, speedy maintaining first is huge for uh, Giants. yeah. And I just want to say, speedy's on 66, like that's ridiculous for someone like I mean, when people think of USA, they think of like super FX as like the main, like you know, the main leader in points. But speedy man, he's he's been coming up, he's been so he's been such a grinder. I think he's probably one of the most underrated players in the community. He doesn't play a lot of lounge, but when he plays wars, man, he like. 
he he scores and he scores a lot and we are seeing that in full force in the finals of the world cup that's insane yeah, I I don't know if Speedy got a world record, but at least he had the world record holder like for a long period of time. Um, this guy just uh, started playing competitive, and he, the the improvement he had just it's just been insane. Like I I didn't, I didn't recall someone uh, starting to play competitive and just improving in uh, that in a short amount of time as he did. Uh, and yeah, yeah, this like having him in the roster is really paying off us. Uh, this ready is actually going to connect into two Japan members. Uh, wow. Members. Uh, really good red spot there as uh, it's a bit of a laggy section uh, at the beginning of every race. So that things are common to happen, but... Um, oh, I think a little bit of a fail there. Interesting to see, normally people actually dip into the underwater, but as, uh, FX does not do that. Yeah, no, it, it's uh, after some trail and error, I think, um, Ooh, going in and it's okay. actually faster, but... Oh, yeah, starting second Oh play. my goodness. That is an insane pull right there. Yeah, this could be a bit uh, bit hard, uh, but he has to be careful not just not to hit it. This blue shield is going to be great for him. It's having a star in first yes. place is amazing. Like, oh, that green is spooky though. Yeah, that, and of course, the guys don't have any reds right now, but uh, if Jibacha can get into second, yeah. So oh, this is really good. Right now, he actually gets so lucky there, just not get bumped. Uh, but we see that the guy in first has a star, so uh, this raid is actually going to not connect. Top I don't five. Know. Look, top top five. five right now. And the oh, shot comes out though. Kibacha dodging though. Uh, someone oh, picking up the star. It's still a top four. Um, yeah, it is. And someone, yeah, No, this is. Oh, start. Speedy getting the bill is going to be clutch. Same as Samuel. Yeah, the bill. This red. Oh, that red's going to be. No, it doesn't connect. But still, the top nice, two is secured for nice, uh, nice. Japan and Haru getting fifth place. Is uh, just what they need. I, I, sadly for him, I I I think that was a bad decision just not to change that star into that set because um, if yeah. there was no, that's the spot to use it. Like exactly. every time, yeah, every time that that, that was a misplay for um, I think yeah, Mashiron had a star, so that could have been an easy top three as Mashiron yeah. next next place there. Uh, uh, being a misplay, I would say. This is honestly that was insane. I thought that USA was done for that race, but those bull pulls were insanely clutch. From I think that was Calm and Speedy right there, if I'm not mistaken. So very, very good for very, very lucky for them to get those bills and bill up to prevent that top four from happening. Uh, that yeah, shock and two build pulls just insane for them. But um, right now we're sitting, I think, in a plus twenty five for. Uh, for USA to give some context, uh, you need a top four to get a plus 19. So Japan needs to do a crazy comeback going into last GP uh, to win the first game. And honestly, it's doable. Like yeah, it's 100% doable. doable. Like I mean, we say that it's like usually it's very rare to see it, but like with how Japan's playing, you can get those big races and win, uh, get that top four, and just be right back into it. They almost did that there in that uh, Rosalina Ice World. Uh, yeah, we, have nice world. we have that shock just uh, i think we yeah we seen a real there's a dc yeah all the daisy cheer uh, <laughs> so you like daisy bro don't you yeah i i that that's one of the best skins uh in the game actually it was not in the first skins too so uh yeah <laughs> some great stuff there uh so sadly um daisy is not like we, we see some players uh in high tiers playing daisy but um it's uh it's Sadly, it's not meta right now. It's it's like MK Wii Daisy, like you know, uh, it's a uh, it's like it's great. Uh, it's still doable to use it, like in competitive. Uh, I've seen some Asia players uh, using it, but um, they like having little characters. Uh, it's just so many advantages over Daisy. Um, yes, yeah, the, the smaller characters just less of a hitbox, and thus like it makes it easier. It makes it easier to or to uh, avoid items. Yeah, and this so game, that's why you don't see a lot of people play like Daisy or Peach. Yeah, but it, it still happens. Like the best ranked player right now, uh, who is uh, and uh, Japan player, uh, isn't playing for um, for this Japan team. I think he doesn't like much four v fours, but he used uh, Peach for a long time and he just grind launch like crazy. Uh, so it's it's still usable, but uh, in these circumstances where uh, you are just trying to win at any cost uh you're trying to win world cup 
uh, you need all the advantage you can and having such a disadvantage uh, uh, as Peach or Daisy, uh, it's it's like not what you're looking for. Uh, especially like in this game, uh, you all the characters go at the same speed, unlike MK8, for example, who uh, like heavy characters uh, have a higher speed stat. In this game, everyone goes at the same speed, but uh, uh, the smaller characters accelerate faster, so that's why they're used. Uh, some some to uh, hitbox stuff and just yeah that's that's why they are meta right now but uh we actually into race um yeah wow. yeah uh, right into it on totes are getting Ooh, what a bag spam i think that was uh, some friendly fire right there yeah uh, Kong, this, yeah no yeah Kong, i think that's and uh <laughs> fx they're on i I'm on accident i'm assuming but like yeah that ha <laughs> just bad. happened so yeah Max Firong actually in 7th place. Uh, he might drop track. here. Yeah, he's yeah, looking to he, drop he, here. He in 8th place, but uh, he's not full Oh, he misses the box. the box. Yeah. This is actually really bad for him, because there's a huge cut right here, and he's not going to be able to catch up right here. The race for him is practically over at this point. Uh, but FX will do something if a, if a shot in team play. Um, which it might be. I, I didn't saw um, Samuel. Uh, oh, this bomb. He was lucky he takes out the heart, but he does have a mega though. Yeah, he has to be careful of any back stamps though. Yeah, he should be getting third place here. Uh, yeah. But he actually hits calm and <gasps> calm drops into seventh place or Six. sixth, yeah, sixth place. Oh, a bit of unfortunate call there. Calm should have gone wide there because of that mega pull. And right. uh, he was he was lucky enough to have a heart just avoiding that debacle bomb because if that bomb hits, it will have been a different story. Yeah, um, but 1 3, 6 8. It's a plus one for um, USA. So uh, if Japan wants a opportunity to win this first game, they they need a top four. Uh, they need a big, 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 big race here because I mean they don't need a top four, but they do need to win this next race by like at least like eight or, or sorry nine, I think, to like have a chance to win this match. Or even like, or am I? Wait, what is it? Twenty six minus nineteen is seven, right? Yeah, it is. Yeah, so, but they, like they, just to force the overtime GP would be really cool, I think. We we almost got that in the Mexican match, but we are going to LA Laps right here. And reverse version, again, huge, not as bad of a uh, notorious respawn as uh, RT, but a very, very uh, significant one as well. At, at least, uh, this track is, um, it's, it has the best target pop in the game, but uh, having this top 3 will practically deny this, uh, all these bomb uh, well, that was a nice attempt, but uh, what I want to say, uh, if you get reddit on the middle of that baseball field, your race is over. You get respawn all the way to the back of the race. We do but, see... Oh, I don't yeah. like this from Samuel back if It's Samuel back there. Kind of double dips on the re on the backwards respawn, and he's super far back. He will be getting A, so this is a prime position for uh, Japan to really catch up right here. Yeah, it's still... The, that guy in 7th place from Japan can, can catch up if he has, for example, a beer or something. Even a star... Uh, yeah, he activates a star, so he will be catching a bit. Uh, he has and a deal. Oh, oh, the shock! This is so clutch. That shock from Samuel, uh, but this deal will help a lot. Uh, uh, Mashiro no. actually getting him into a pretty good spot here. He didn't respond there, but uh, it's really not necessary. Like, it saves a bit amount of time, but... Yeah, uh, oh, he gets ready out. No, I think that's, that's it. That, yeah, that, that's it. That's, yeah, that's a that's tough thing to get out for USA and... Uh, wow. Top three. three. Uh, oh no, top two four. Okay. No. Oh, <laughs> Speedy just dies on the line. Oh no. But top two five. That is a United States win, and it's not just a United States win. It's a dominant United States win right here. This USA winning in race eleven might be the best and the biggest upset uh, ever done to a uh, Japan team, like uh, a Japan team in in World Cup editions. Um, just. Insane. I, I, I actually have to say I didn't expect uh, something that big to happen. Uh, but uh, how was Yusa playing? Uh, at, at least uh, uh, like in race two, I started to smell something like uh, they, they, they are just playing so good and uh, Japan actually made a big, big mistake in bagging. Uh, but uh, yeah. we, now saw, we now saw what happens if you don't back. As uh, Samuel got several shocks over there and even like, e even, like Japan members dodging like one of two dodging, but uh, USA members dodging too. So um, it was 
it was a bit more advantageous for uh, USA at least because yeah. that like you Japan getting that top spots uh, early on denied some of them uh, to get a heart so so yeah we have we have yet to see what happen uh, when USA doesn't get the shock and Japan is in top spots that will be uh, really interesting to see uh, going into match two because Japan has to need uh, needs to to do uh, some uh, at, at least uh, mindset adjustments at, at the very least yeah. because. Uh, they are really capable of doing this, uh, but this re this uh, match they will uh, completely uh, outsmarted by USA members. Great job for them. And I think we will be getting a disconnect uh, right here. So, uh, yeah, we see the <laughs> what is that, Captain? Not Captain Toad. Oh. <sighs> you, know, you know the what, what is that one called? Yeah, pit, pit crew, I think. Uh, pit crew, Toad. I, that's such a random name. I would have never guessed that. But I, yeah, I, I yeah, I don't know why I know that name, but yeah, we we actually seen a reopen just uh, for last race. Yeah, we should. I think what we should do is maybe talk about what USA did well because I'm I'm just gonna say because I I do know the USA guys pretty well, so I do have some insight. I will say that. Even if like a lot, of, actually the people did predict uh, USA to uh, to win this, but um, I think a lot of like a lot of people who are veteran because like they saw Mexico not take down Japan, are like, oh okay, Japan has won this. But USA was very very confident. I remember talking, they were like, oh yeah, we have the best play style versus Japan, we can easily beat them, and they've taken like scrims handedly up over Japan. But this is like probably the most dominant I've ever seen them versus uh, Japan right now, and. I mean, that led to a 1-0 for uh, the United States. It'll be interesting to see if Japan does win the second match, how the United States will bounce back. But um, it, it, I'm not worried about Japan right now. Like, this isn't worrying. I think Japan, oof, honestly, we saw this in the Mexico match. They are insane at adapting. Yeah. As, um, I think... Uh... Yeah, but I, I'm not sure, like, what will they do to uh, counter uh, this guy? Because if they back, uh, USA just uh, got into the top spot really quick and uh, just ended, that, ended them, uh, that's just all running. And Samuel being in the back, lack, like, uh, something, the only thing that Japan could lack at this game is a really good hard bagger. Uh, because uh, they, they surely know how to bag, like, every top player uh, could easily go and drop and just uh, get a good bagging battle, but uh, there are some exceptional players who have really crazy experience at bagging, and they can outbag every uh, top player that decides to try and fight them. So uh, for most of the time, uh, USA bagger will be a place. So uh, right. if that's the case, and they can't take the USA members uh, quick enough, uh, USA will have a great, great advantage. And if uh, if it's the other case around and Japan members are in top spots, uh, there could be easily a talking play by a USA member in the last place. Or uh, if they decide not to bag at all, uh, USA has even greater chances to uh, shock there. So uh, definitely something that Japan has to uh, think. It's probably the be the uh, hardest issue that uh, Japan has ever encountered in, in a match like uh, dealing with the bagger is uh, yeah, like you usually are just really great runners overall and just are capable of winning without uh, having a hard bagger but this time they just got uh, completely outrun by uh, USA members and their pack play and their item play so yeah um, yeah again we are this is the 12th race of the uh, final um, of the final of war number one USA has already won this but um I was just playing this for fun, playing this for pride. Uh, maybe playing this for like, just to get some reset, like a mental reset as well for Japan maybe. But um, I mean, we've been hearing their voice co communication and I don't think, th they don't sound tilted. Like they sound very calm, they said, okay, we can just do this, we can do that, and whatnot. So I'm not worried for them. And I, know, I think out of like every team, I think they do have the best mental, probably them and United States, who are our two um, champions right here. Or two finalists right here. Yeah. So you see them, you can hear them. Like they're playing hard. They're like, okay, we have to do this, we have to do that. Um, but yeah. Oh, that's 
Mega. Rip. That yeah, that 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 mega yeah. cut is really that, rough. Yeah, that's just rip. Um, but yeah, I have to say, uh, even uh, when I played like there's two, uh, all two uh, SDK members. Um, well, one of the SDK member uh, in Japan lineup. Uh, when we play with them, and even where we are losing, they are just um, they're just don't sound tilt tilt at all. Like they're just confident, mm -hmm. just uh, in coming back and just win at the end. And um, yeah, so uh, that, that having a great mentality just uh, is just great. Uh, for example, even I, who have a lot of experience uh, like playing into um, high high divisions, like important matches, I still feel a bit nervous, you know, if I'm playing like uh, a very very important match. But uh, these guys just um, like even <laughs> even the win against Mexico when everything was just. Uh, looking so grim for them they they didn't just like at the end Ivacha was the only one was popping off and the other members were like right. yeah we won great ggs and then, like mm -hmm. ah, <laughs> you, you great you made a great win there but um like i think I, I i don't know what to say like i am expecting to see what happens in this match number two Great stuff for uh, USA, by the way. The, the best performance I have seen uh, by them so far, and just uh, just amazing, amazing stuff for those guys. They're just popping up in call, probably. Yeah. So, um, I believe. I mean, that's it. That's like the first match. We do have a second match. This is the best of three. So. United States hasn't won it yet, but it is looking like a very, very strong, like, it was a strong USA win, in my opinion. Um, and we will uh, see a second match. Uh, hopefully this goes to match three, you know. I really do like to see match threes. It'd be super hype, especially we got two really good match threes uh, for the semifinals. It'd be nice to see a, uh, another um, SF3 uh, that goes the distance. Uh, for this uh, for this World Cup as well, or for this final as well, but yeah, we will be taking I think a round a six minute break. We'll be back at fifty five, but uh, please don't go anywhere. Uh, United States versus Japan for Mario Kart Tour match two will be coming up very very shortly. Yeah. All right, we are back with match two. Uh, if you just missed, missed match one, uh, the United States, um, I wouldn't say dominantly, but they took care of business in match one by, I think, a 28 point, yeah, 28 point uh, win in match one. But uh, Japan is very, very well known for adapting, and we will see uh, how they will adapt in match two. Um, before we get into the match, we do have a substitute coming up from Japan. I believe um, Haruru or Haruru will be subbed out for um, Ozuimu, so we'll see Ozuimu play or Ozuimu. I think you know how to pronounce it better than me, Sanch. Yeah, Ozuimu. Um, Ozuimu really talented, okay. really talented uh, Japan player. Um, he has been top ten in lounge uh, for. A high amount of time, and he is known in Japan for winning a lot of tournaments too. Like everyone in Japan can win tournaments, but uh, especially Ozimo has won some bunch of them. So uh, it will be great to have him play. Like he has a very good playstyle, as I've seen in Tier B. Um, but uh, they are suffering for uh, right now. Uh, USA uh, item plays at the beginning and just getting the top spots really quickly. Uh, maybe um, they need to like. Either play more aggressive. Uh, I'm talking about Japan side. Either play more aggressive or uh, just try not to get hit at any point, like at any cost. Because um, there are some uh, like you can you can play conservative, but uh, you have to be careful uh, and think about the uh, worst possible scenario. For example, a red in fifth place that will respawn you backwards. It's not that um, scuff to happen, and if that happens, then you're completely out. So uh, having um, like the inside of what's the ro the worst thing that can happen to you and at the same time just balance that with uh aggressive playing and just don't let usa uh get into the front because uh like having a top three even having a top three is not the best for japan as uh samuel will be eighth place always and if a shot comes 
and they just won't touch even if they're Japan. So um, I don't know. Maybe can they can try uh, like having first place, but then have four and five just to get dodges or something along those lines. But uh, at the very least, just maybe hope for Samuel just not to get so many shocks. Uh, Would be maybe the, the ideal thing to happen because um, yeah, they they got really lucky with shocks at, at least that last war um, with Edge Fortress shock and um, and overall like. Shocks at the end, uh, those top uh, dodges uh, from Speedy and FX. Uh, USA trying to replicate that and Japan uh, needing to adapt to that. Uh, they are great at adapting, as you said, so I'm, I'm eager to see what they do. As, uh, yeah, Haruru gets subbed out for Zuimo. That's, I think, the only line of change. And here we go. Nice. Okay, we are getting started right now. And... Um... Very interesting. We are starting on Rosalina's Ice or Rosalina Ice World Trick. Uh, yep. It's kind of an awkward track, in my opinion. You know, you do have a lot of kind of dangerous obstacles. You have the penguin uh, at the ice section in lap one, and uh, and the other, <laughs> another penguin in the other on the road section in lap two to avoid. So we'll see. We do see Baseball Club bagging, I believe. No, please don't. <laughs> Sanch is wondering why. We were talking in break, like, oh, we shouldn't have Baseball Club bag because, you know, he's a really strong player. But I guess they're not listening to us. I mean, I don't know. They're in World Cup Finals, we're not Sanch, so they probably have a better strategy than us. Yeah. I, I <laughs> but, have to uh, move more in Japan. Uh, that's... <laughs> so, um, <laughs> yeah, as you say, this track uh, a bit weird, but at the very least, really good at front running. Uh, only three sets of boxes, unlike the uh, normal version who has four. Um, yeah, right now having mixed spots is good for Japan as um, there's a bagging battle, but uh, yeah, having a bagging battle will decrease the possibilities of shock to happen. So um, maybe it's not the best I should be having mixed, uh, mixed spots as we see an early top two for uh, USA. And uh, he has to be careful here uh, just not to get trailed there. Uh, yeah, hit. spacing yeah, yeah. Spacing is especially key in this game because. Lag hits, or you know, you don't know what's gonna happen. You see a sniper tap from FX and Chrono Street could not get Oz Ozuimu right there. And yeah, Ozuimu he actually has a good setup right there. Yeah, he's Most actually a great spot. Now he has to be careful here. If he hits the penguin, uh, he will, it, it will be bad for the NAS. Uh, UFX maybe. Yeah, he actually hit the penguin and yeah. he lost the second place. Uh, but. Uh, oh, fourth place box from uh, FX. Unfortunately, it only gets shrooms. Yeah, I think the Inter has reds. He has to be careful though. Uh, like, there's nothing he can do actually, but... Um, yeah, that's not the case, and FX getting those two red shells. And at the top two for... Uh, oh, oh, the back! That back spam is going to be great, but... It's not gonna uh, lose any spots for yeah, Japan though. Lose any spots. But it's still a great effort though, for FX. Um, th that, that was a really, really, um, like, crazy uh stream spot because um let me say like there was a high chance like japan members got that box in second place at least one of them so um right. shrooming late as he shroomed late i uh, led him to get the box in fourth place getting two shrooms there uh he was lucky enough to uh, have that japan member like in, that got the box in second place uh to be lead uh to fourth place or to have uh his their, their red shields lagged away because uh, if what that wasn't the case uh, FX could have very easily died there, and uh, but yeah, still, um, yeah, I, I will have suggested maybe just uh, shroom a bit earlier and get the box in second place, yeah, yourself. But it paid mm. off. Again. So uh, great stuff for USA as they are back into the lead, starting this match too. And yeah, I don't want to say anything, but um, that was a great race. I do see Japan do is doing a lot better at like keeping up with USA though. That was very very close. And if you know they did pull the double reds or they didn't get breaking off, then USA could have the Japan could have won that race honestly. Yeah. Um. But uh, we do see ooh nice snipe out. But he snipes out his own team uh, and hits the chain chomp. Oh no. That's not the best for them. As um, one Japan member is in last place. I think yeah it's baseball again, but um. Early top three for uh, uh top two, sorry for uh, Japan, and uh, if they can nullify the shock, uh, they're just good to go. As uh, Ozuimo has a mushroom in first place, maybe he decides to take the, sh the shortcut uh, instead of holding this because of um, 
Mashiron uh, actually going to take it too. Uh, FX gets lucky and pulls a monster. I mean, all these green shell actually not. Oh my to... goodness! I think it broke into a guy. I think this is this is very very good. If a shock shock is very rare in here, so we might not see a shock, and this would be a really good, really good race for uh, Japan right here. Shock should and have. You see a blue though coming. Shell, so uh, this will be. Uh, oh, he managed to avoid Sorry. the blue shell. Uh, nice he's... avoid right there. Maybe at one three four. Uh, for Japan, um, uh, yeah. So. They got the top spots early on, and uh, yeah, FX, I think, yeah, it was FX who sniped, uh, I think it was, uh, I'm not sure who it was, but... FX, uh, FX sniped Speedy, I believe, Speedy, and then he ran into the chain chomp, unfortunately. Oh, yeah. I will say this, the counterplay is sometimes to, uh, to the USA's very aggressive plays that sometimes they just hit themselves, and they just, you know, fail, they just fail as well, and... You see right there, Super FX getting hit or hitting yeah. Speedy right there and, and taking him out, and then hitting the Chin Chump. Unfortunately, kind of compounds that damage and leads leads uh, the United States to not really get up there at the beginning of the race, which is really key. Yeah, I I want to talk about something about uh, like what FX did right there. So, um, definitely in in some sometimes like uh, spamming your your green shell there uh, or a, for uh, for example a, a red shell. Uh, it's not actually the worst play as uh, if you do that uh, having high chances of hitting a uh, japan member uh with of course having the risk of hitting your teammate but uh for the most time it actually pays off but uh, sadly there it actually hit speed and uh of course that chain jump hit was not uh calculated for him like he didn't calculate no. that so um but japan actually did uh like they got the top spots early and just Babel decided to drop just to uh um, avoid the shock yeah yeah, exactly. So, yes. we, yeah, we are going to uh, Toad Circuit right here, and um, really yeah. good Mega Pool actually. Yeah, the, the uh, interesting to see him hold it. I actually I like him holding this because he has all of his teammates behind him, so he might like get a box here. Ooh, a bomb! That's a very interesting pull right here. Maybe he'll. Oh, nice, nice, nice attempt there. His bomb is not going to connect, but the Mega is going to be really good as uh, he is going to Mega into second place. And uh, he, if he can stay in second place, just pressuring the guy in first. Oh, uh, that banana step was so close. Yeah, oh. still having two protections, but uh, if FX just start changing reds, oh, he doesn't have any red. Um, so if no shock or blue, this should be uh, easy first for Japan. Uh, but all this bomb. Oh, that bomb was so scary. Uh, I, oh yeah, so he pulls a heart only. It's not enough for uh, getting mushroom in first spot. Still have many rates for USA. As they oh, oh no! Oh. Fifth place. This actually comes down to the bagging battle. No, it's 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 over. I think. Um, oh, is it? Oh, okay. So winning race by one for Japan. Race by one. Japan and uh, things are looking a lot more close than in the first match, at least for now. <coughs> yeah. Um. Very. Yeah. It's looking a lot close, and honestly, I feel like. Uh, that red play, or I don't know what happened to. It. I think Comp just got hit out at the end, or just got passed, and very, very unfortunate for him. But maybe he couldn't pull enough items to like catch up, or maybe he got hit out or something. But that fifth, that uh, that winning race really, it, it, it helps a lot, man. Like it, it helps a lot. And uh, we just see Baseball Club again, hagging right here. I like having one bagger is not that strange, but having the best play, one of the best players in the world. Uh, uh, without any doubt, bagging is for sure what's well, strange right here. I mean, yeah. it's working out. Like they're keeping up with the United or with USA right now. So, I mean, it's working for now. And nice uh, beginning right there for oh. Super FX. Ooh. I, and... I think it's bouncing to someone, but I'm not sure into who. Uh, but yeah, early top spots for uh, USA, as we say, like as happened last last race. Uh, if they're able to hold this, then they're just gone as uh, major of the tracks on this tour are just uh, great at front running presence and uh, this is one of them for sure uh, also, but, but um, I, I do want to mention the shock battle though baseball club in last and this is actually very very huge yeah and he's last by a, by quite a bit actually not not that like yeah but yeah having uh, oh the, I think that was a blue shell pool yeah it Ooh. was uh, yeah. Speedy gets blue and um, I think it's uh, it's not a swim why I'm not sure who they're holding their dodges. They might have shot if he doesn't change here Yeah, no, he changed here uh, because he have oh, a, 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 he should have changed anyway, so um 
Even if they have shock, uh, the spots are in the mid. Uh, maybe if Hibacha is able to pull something here, they will throw it. Uh, if not, then just... I think it's pretty has a star. Is that a star or is that a mana? I, I'm, I can't quite tell. Uh, I think it's a star, yeah. So yeah. if the shock comes, uh, it should be coming here at least uh, if they have it, but I don't think so. Oh, so we make it hit out. And it's looking really good for USA. It, I yeah, think that is a star. A star, yeah. He's gonna use it early. There's not a there's not a shocking play, and uh, oh, Ooh, I'm gonna clutch. Okay. Another blue shell for uh for Japan. Two blue shells, and this blue is going to do a lot of damage. If this red, oh he no. Okay, he tried to. Oh, I think I hit calm. Yeah. That that hit calm. Maybe he got six play because of that. Oh. 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 Where's the results? Where's the results? Um, that's oh no. Thing. One, three, five, seven. Oh, interesting. We need race Where... for... Hey, what happened? Why that blue shield didn't connect? Maybe he I connected on calm, I think, but I think Speedy and... F or Speedy and FX oh, were just up there as well. Okay. Oh, there was a DC! No, that's... Oh, that's so unfortunate. Oh, it's Wimu DC. Oh, Wimu DC. Yeah. Oh, that's Speedy so unlucky. Thirty one after four races, I think, or yeah, three. yeah, no, three, no, four, yeah. four, four. <laughs> yeah, this is, yeah, but very unlucky DC. Unfortunately, there won't be like a reset there. Um, yeah, hopefully, he's able to uh, rejoin in time. Uh, oh but, yeah, for sure. I mean, yeah, that that's what happens. Like, if you have a DC in mid race, you're doomed to have that eight spot. Uh, and because of that, that that's why you, we make reopens here. Like having a uh, lobby of eight players is a lot more like depending on DCs uh, than, for example, a lobby with fifteen players. For example, uh, a people in sorry, both players. Fifteen. Sorry, I want. Ah yes, my maybe in Mario Kart Nine they'll put fifteen players and not twelve players. Yeah, yeah we do see a DC here, so oh, we will be I seeing a know. room open. Yeah, and. Uh, there's someone uh, streaming, like some someone sniping uh, this stream, uh, at least for uh, some of these streamers. So uh, yeah. they have to be at least careful on uh, on like hiding the code. Yeah, stop stream sniping. Yeah, so some <laughs> sniping. Yeah, uh, sadly, uh, there's some yeah. players who uh, don't. The, the, yeah, I mean, it's part of it's unfortunately part of the game. Uh, the room code being up there, but yeah, it happens, you know. Just have to deal with it, and Machiron's still racing, so it's fine. Yeah. But uh, we will be going to, I think, a uh, bit of a break right here, or a little bit short, like intermission before we get back into it. But um, yeah, sure. it, uh, I mean, honestly, a lot closer than the first match, hundred yeah, percent. Sure. Uh, still a winning lead uh, for USA. They can still um, like keep that up for sure. Uh, but uh, Japan, like, they decided to bag more races now, and uh, they, like, if it wasn't for that DC, that that, that, that race, I think, uh, pull, uh, put uh, USA into the back into the lead, because that bottom two really hurts, and, right. uh, yeah, so, uh, it, like, having baseball club bagging is at least paying uh, with, their, like, there's no shocks, but, um, uh, the, like, there's still a close battle between uh, who's getting into the top spots. Um, oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so, so yeah, I don't know if you can see it on our screen, but yeah, maybe they key don't. Uh, Machine's keyboard is really funny. But um, anyways, uh, yeah, as your point, I think bagging is actually not that bad. I mean, it may be weird to see baseball club bagging, but I mean, it's not that bad of a strategy. It does keep the wars a lot closer. So like if you do need to catch up and have baseball club run, then you have that opportunity for him to run, and then you can, you, they can, you can force uh, USA to get like a t bottom two or bottom three, and then really really like come up at the very end. Yeah, um, I maybe something that um, didn't that, that isn't quite happening right now because uh, sometimes it's Japan in the lead and sometimes it's USA in the lead. Uh, at least for last war, I think the amount of red shells that uh have been happening at least on the first box or second box has decreased uh like a lot because of like red shells last match uh was the pain uh for japan members as most of them uh, got hit early on and then just uh usa members all they need was just to run 
uh, because their bagging, the bagging battle was uh, unfolding. So uh, this time, it, it there hasn't been uh, like enough uh, early hits for Japan members. So uh, war is war is a lot closer right now. So maybe that focus like on not get hit at the beginning is uh, really paying off for them as uh, the war right now is uh, like everyone anyone can win uh, because it's just only race four and things are just looking really close uh yeah and um it's very interesting to uh kind of see as we are going back to april freeway r and um i like to actually want to say that this is probably one of my favorite tracks in the game like by far the, the entire maple yeah no no just maple tree way in general oh okay yeah i really love this it's a very very well done track i think everybody loves this track i don't really know anyone who really hates this track in the community i mean i don't i don't but i i especially don't like that much uh reverse version over uh the normal order uh, because of the ending the ending is the worst yeah oh, fair enough. and ooh, we do see uh kyle getting hit out right there or super fx getting hit out right there why is and, he uh ooh. oh he actually got like he actually got baited i think samuel got baited there and i think yeah it happens baseball club should be getting the box in eight place here and uh right. he to pull the shot like in second place it would be great for them, uh, as uh, Wendy gets taken out uh, over there. That's a bit of a messy line, but oh, it's very cool. Baseball club is up to six. That back actually connected to him. Yeah. yeah. So who should last? That's my question. At least it's not uh, Mashiron, I think. Uh, he should be. Uh, oh, that red. I think oh, he actually. Red. Yeah, he did. This is really, really good for Japan right now. Yeah, this and... helps. It has a great lead. Right now, even um, like maybe he could attempt a uh, green snipe if he gets one here, uh, but I yeah, that's like all he can do. Just expect a shock from uh, Samuel, who is in last right now and got the box in last place. So maybe there's a shock um, that could save uh, USA because it's not then. Oh, <laughs> speak of the devil, the shock does come out and uh, FX is dodging. He will be getting. First, barring anything, and top two right now for USA, so he will be definitely getting first. Top three even for the United States. My yeah. goodness. And I think they're just gonna keep this, unless- Ooh, that lucky shroom right there. Uh, no, this was just- Oh, oh. That this is what really bad. Room after all. <laughs> yeah. And he will be getting hard. He will be catch up, though. This is gonna be a very crazy ending, I think. Yeah, but um, I don't think he will catch enough. Uh, but still a win race uh, for oh, you. Oh, what happened at the end? Maybe that backstab actually. I think. Maybe. I don't know. It, it might have been this backstab. It might have been a snipe as well. But USA getting one three five because of that. That's insane. I think it was a backstab. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Yeah, because... But how did two? Wait, but how did Calm get third? That's what I'm wondering. Yeah, I think I... Calm was enough. Uh, enough ahead to uh out bypass uh the guy in four, but uh. He should have. He should be getting like. If that happened, if that was the case, he should have gotten uh, four place. So, I do believe that was a backspam from Speedy. Yeah. Just crossing that out. Uh, but again, even more clutch was uh, Samuel uh, shock pull over there. Just exactly one Jap what uh, USA needed at the exact moment. So great for him. Uh, yeah. but and we were talking about you know Sam getting baited a little bit, but he does still pull the shock, luckily, and that's very very clutch for the unit for USA because it turns out Japan top two into a USA win. Yeah, I, I I think if it was baseball club in last place, that shock could have been uh, one hundred percent avoidable. But uh, the fact that it was another Japan member bagging who isn't aware, like just um, the like. Bagging, uh, like maybe he wasn't even using gyro uh, to start off, and uh, yeah, Samuel, like had, he had a great uh, east lead, let's say like that, but he was able to get eighth place regardless. Uh, so I think gyro was a great uh, factor there. As we see him into a uh, Chip Island, normal yeah, early top, yeah, early top three right now for, for top spots for Japan right now. Yeah, um, from this track, if there's a shock in play, but um, yeah. Yeah, effects with this um, this pool is actually great. Uh, uh, bad for him, he actually didn't uh, draft there. 
it could be huge if he did so but um I don't know like if you mega here you're not able to get the second uh shortcut but uh yeah he will hold it and just mega over here and um you have to be careful though just not to hit his teammate. Uh he's yeah. stuck I think yeah. maybe or calm does hit out. oh no calm doesn't hit on anyone. No. Yeah. Oh this is gonna be looking oh, very good. Had to chill. Oh we so. see Samuel catching up. Okay, yeah, Samuel he doesn't have a shot. Come through, oh, come through dying, but... What? Whoa, oh my goodness. Oh, that was... What happened over what? there? Why are you I'm so confused. Like, what happened there? Wait, did he not chain his items? It's a random in the room. It, it shouldn't be. No, I, I... Oh. I'm entirely... We got bamboozled there. What happened? What did the effects did that? Like, of course, mm -hmm. yeah, Comtrus died. Okay. Yeah, but yeah. But there was zero reason not to chain his items. And uh, he, he he missed the chain, and he actually threw a green forward to barely miss it Samuel uh, on the real, like, game, because on his screen actually hit it. But if if that green shell hits it, um, that will be the end for Samuel. So something red happened. Uh, oh, we're getting yeah, uh, uh, okay. the news here from uh, our detectives. Um, he <laughs> our thought, detectives? Actually, yeah, his touch actually messed it up yeah. uh, at the very end. So, sadly for him, yeah. Um, even like even he, he, if he got the chain, uh, maybe he wouldn't have gotten like a spot higher than fifth. But, um, yeah, still, still an unfortunate move there. As baseball, it doesn't take it, it, it doesn't take away from. Japan like winning that race. I Japan yeah. still wins that race, but yeah. it was just a little bit questionable play right there from FX. Um, hopefully, we won't see too much more control fails uh, for him, as we do see uh, one for five for um, Japan right now. And oh, we do see Ozumi getting hit out in a top two right now, but we will see Shirin shimming up right now. Yeah, FX right now in 6th place, uh, Japan having more from presence, I think, that at, le uh, for, at least, uh, like, last war. Um, top to 4, uh, Comfort's getting back, I think, or, he, yeah, like, he got back, for sure. I uh, did back, backstone attempt was just really great, really, it's really hard to hit someone on that spot, uh, but it actually paid up for uh, Japan members as they have a lead into the top 2. And, but this mushroom will actually be very, very, very pog as if he affects. Okay, he actually. Ooh, he changed it. Interesting he, choice right there. Another, he actually got the best pull he could, but uh, I think of the different order because. If oh, this is super out, risky. Yeah, they, he's gonna get redded. He's going to oh, get wait, red. no. He didn't? Oh, I think uh, Speedy tanked the red. You have to be careful. Yeah, oh, he spams here, it. Yeah. He gets it. He gets it, but. Um, will he get first? Oh, this is such oh, a close ending. No, he does get it, but one four five. One four five, and uh, I'm honestly surprised why uh, the guy is in first place didn't use his horn immediately because uh, that, like, that green shell broke his second red. So if he spammed his horn, he will be safe uh, for the like mm. for the ending. And uh, I know Japan members don't usually spam their items there. Uh, but uh, they're they're fighting against someone who do actually does uh, spam their items really quick. Uh, if they right. have the opportunity, like they, 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 if they have the shot, they will capitalize on the shot like very quickly. So Japan members should like they they're one hundred percent capable of doing that. Uh, but I'm actually surprised they didn't. Like knowing their rivals and knowing how are they been playing like last match and this match, the call was one hundred percent to spam your horn there. Uh, there was even a chance that he. Hits um, both of the reds, but uh, like that, like I, it was so sad to see. Like I knew that was going to happen before before even seeing that. Uh, so yeah, bad play for Japan, I'd say. Yeah, but we are going into uh, Airship Fortress R, and this is another you know Airship Fortress is very very big front running track, but also a lot of boxes as well. So shock will be, you will probably see a shock here. Um, because it is very long as well. Oh, um, everyone running. Ooh, interesting. Everyone's running here. And, oh, I think Speedy gets hit out, and that's a top four for Japan. This is actually really, really good. That backstone attempt is actually not the worst, but, but sadly it wasn't, like, it's not possible to hit him if, if he's so close. 
Maybe he will opt to drop here just to get this red out. It will be really huge because. Oh my goodness! Yeah. He has it right now, yeah. do it. Uh, I mean, oh, FX, really good reaction, but still really good because it gets rid of one dodge. And now we see mushroom uh, dropping. Yeah, dropping because uh, the top spots are really, uh, really good right now. And good uh, reaction from Samuel to you know, identify that he's dropping right there. Yeah, he, like the only thing he has to do is getting the box in eighth place. But uh, if if I even it, drop harder. even here, like just making Sam stay back there so he doesn't really get shocked was really good. But he will get another eighth place box, and we see Mastro right now oh, catching up. Actually, the top three from Japan is actually is broken, and uh, Jivacha hitting something. Um, oh no! It's over right now, and the only thing they need to do. Uh, is just maintain this one three. If they this red shields pull, oh, oh three. Broken. yeah, sadly, uh, it could have done a bit of mad of a damage uh, coming into this box. Don't Late shock. Oh and, no, uh, this is gonna be really really good for USA. That top two is going to disappear, but I don't know if anyone dodged though. Calm maybe dodges, I think. Maybe he the only dodge. But he gets a red. Oh, oh dear, my god! god. <gasps> no, actually the red surpasses the one who is the star. And actually hits super effect. That's a winning race for Japan. That's a barely winning race for Japan. So, yeah. oh my goodness. So, dude, I, so me, you can correct me if I'm wrong. But because I think Mashrina throws a red, right? Mm -hmm. And then Kyle, it, and because Speedy wasn't a star, it passes Speedy and goes for Kyle. And then Kyle just throws his green shell away and he gets redded for it and getting last. I just mean, a split second decision right there, changing a USA win to a Japan win. Yeah, but. That, that was like highly improbable, like <laughs> getting a star in 5th place, okay, right, that, that's okay. But uh, Mashiron got a red shell in 6th place. And yeah. the purpose of having a red shell and throw it and just miss the guy in 5th because it was in a star and getting the guy in 4, that's just, that's just ridiculous. Like, it like, affects 100% through that because like he had a team member behind him, but that, that was just... A uh, series of unfortunate events that led yeah. up to uh, USA losing that race, but uh, that's a uh, plus four, plus four. So sorry, uh, for uh, USA, I think we have like four races left, so it's it's still anyone's game right now. As uh, Rainbow Road uh, Classic Japan has uh, mm. FX gets straight there and Mashiron in first with a mushroom, uh, almost secured the win unless a shock happens. Yeah. Uh, oh, but his teammates yeah, are in. Yeah. We see uh, you see oh, in second right now. Oh no, not I anymore. Oh my red, goodness. Red got uh, much around there. Uh, gets punished for that top three for top three for Japan and also in sixth place. He's gonna probably drop here, right? No, he won't. No, you have to like catch up right now. As uh, it, like okay, yeah, you turn to catch up, but uh, this track just is not the best to catch up. As uh, so this top three, if there's not a shocking play, uh, Kyle often did not use his star. He has to use it right now, and shock is. This is so clutch. So, yeah. Oh, oh what's he making shock? At the last frame, Givacha gets taken out. Come dodging into second place. Maybe first now. So Two, four, place. five, seven. What a. Seven. What a shock. Oh, that first. shock pull was so lucky, or not lucky, but so clutch. I oh, know. I thought he was in last place. I think he had yeah. it uh, after the bill. Oh my goodness. Insane. Well, we're seeing about Samuel just insane stuff. And uh, still, that race uh, turned again uh, like it was a plus 11 for Japan and turned into a plus one for them. Again, with one shock. And heading into last GP with a plus three difference uh, for USA. I don't know what to say. They're like, I don't know. A shock can th turn things. Uh, down so easily like if there wasn't a shock there it would be a different story right now i think but still uh, like amazing job we, we can see so far from from both teams i think japan uh adapted really quickly uh to the situation that they fought at the first war but uh right now there are three races left just three points away both teams and Things are going to look really exciting as we're now going into Toad Circuit, a really shock heavy track. Um, so let's see, let's see if we're having uh, something hot coming out. Like we do see it's bagging, but just a little bit. 
as uh, Japan members are actually going into the front, but uh, not actually trying to back. So I'm not sure what the strategy is on this track. Like, yeah, it, like you can't, you can't really like be confident about shock not going to happen because. Uh, but so far, uh, every track that um, USA needs the shock, they got it. Mm. And uh, all this red is going to be... Why? Uh, like, I don't know why he reds him before the box, but... Uh, right. Yeah, he's going to get two and points. he gets punished for it, for it. you just mentioned. And uh, unless, like... Yeah, the shock is actually going to come oh, and... Star. Oh my goodness. Oh, I hate this game, bro. I hate this game. For real. And uh, two, three, four. Right now, for USA, the only thing they need to do is hit the guys who dodge from Japan because this bomb is going to nullify all Japan members oh in the match. All three will get taken out, and this is not. Oh it, my it, god, it, is this it, a top four? No, it's not. No, it's top three, five. Ah, uh, nah. The, the, what? Why? Why? Why, Japan? Why? You're bagging every track, and you're not bagging the most important track that you need to bag. I don't know what they are thinking, and. This race can be the end for Japan if they don't manage to uh, fight a response, like find a response. They have two races left, but this, like, they're right now in a, such a great spot, such a great moment for USA. Like, these shocks just, like, they're, they're getting the shocks when they need it. Like, this shock festival is just benefiting in every way, uh, like, Japan and like I'm really surprised. For example, with uh, Mexico, uh, we saw at least two shots in seventh place for uh, Japan, but this time it's just an all-in from Samuel. Just all the shots had been for the USA, and Japan is just not having a response. This shock was really crucial, and if they decided to run on a shock heavy track, and they get hard punished for that. Hard. If USA wins this race, they are going to be the World Cup champions. Yeah. It's a plus 20 lead for Japan, or for USA. Top 4 is a plus 19. So, if J Japan needs- this is a must win for Japan. And we are going to Kalamori, and a top 4 start for Japan right here. But again, you mentioned Shock being such a huge part in USA's com- uh, USA's uh, com- And not only just Shock, but USA is doing a really good job coming back as well. Uh, if USA gets a Shock- Oh, uh, I think there's a DC. <laughs> Oh uh, no, there's no shot, there's a DC! <laughs> oh my goodness! Yeah, I, I was about to say, if USA gets the shock in the second box and denies uh, all Japan players from taking the shortcut, that's just GG over there, like, there's no way. There's no way you come back for that. But sadly, we're seeing a DC and um, with two races left, this is, like, if this is what Japan needs, maybe, because that uh, reset of the room, uh, in Spanish we call it Cambio de Aires, from like, there's some moments that, for example, on a, on a launch, that you're doing really bad, and then a reopen happens, and then after the reopen, you're actually doing great. Uh, same thing happens backwards, like you're doing a great launch, and then someone reopens the room, and then your luck just disappears, and you just completely die. So, um, let's see, like this race, like this reopen is actually going to reset at least uh, Japan's like anemic situation but like that's that's like one of the worst things that had happened to you but i i really don't like that play i certainly don't like uh, like you're bagging every single track you are um doing great yeah at bagging but you decide not to bag the most important track so far to bag like the shock circuit instead of top circuit like i don't know what you're thinking of like of course, you're launch players, you're experimented in launching, you know like where to use your dodges uh, to, great, to get uh, the most efficient way to win in the race. But you're playing USA and these guys just shocking early on. Like, of course they won't wake, they won't wait to, um, to the gliding section when you say like, okay, yeah, go into the glider and just mitigate the, the, the shocks. Uh, they just, just know just shock them uh, before even they actually have a chance to respawning and uh, even like FX getting shocked in 7th place wasn't the worst for him as he can easily catch up but getting that star there just, just was just great for him and uh, he actually didn't end in uh, 
into the top three, uh, even yeah. without you. Um, if there's a race that Japan needs to do right now, it's actually this one. Like they did a, a good performance here, but um, they just need a not a shockless race at least for the USA. And uh, I think they should be good as uh, Country is actually getting this red. Yes. And Knight from speeding Knight. Knight. Yeah, top, top two, two right, right now, now for Japan or top for two. USA right here. No, oh, oh, oh bomb! It oh, was a bomb snipe from Jibacha, I believe. Hard, and yeah. two, three, four now. Two, three, four, five, and um, uh, stop having anyone into the bottom spots. No baseball club hits the net oh, now. No. <laughs> it's still two, three, four though. That green snipe is gonna. Oh, no, no one no. doesn't miss his father. The bomb though! This is. Oh my, my goodness, they're throwing everything in the kitchen. Contrast gets hit out. Oh, he didn't need to throw that red. He will be thick. Okay, maybe he, he can. Right here. Oh no, he doesn't. Uh, yeah, so, um, yeah, one, three, one, one, three, five, seven right now. Uh, still, still possible, like, to have a shocking play. Yeah. And if that's oh. the case, it will happen at the last moment. Oh! Yeah, yeah, that's a red red shock. No, wait, no, no, no. It's extra. It's effect with the shock, and it should be. This is gonna be so clutch. This no. ending is gonna be so clutch. Oh, what is that? It's a top four. Uh, the shot comes in. And oh, baseball club dodges. Yeah, baseball club dodging. Tivache is already really, really ahead. Even like, it will be it's really It's gonna be a top two. This will they be can, in. They can hold the top two. They have a chance. If they can hold yeah, this. Yeah, yeah, they hold it. They held it. They held it. They did. They did. Oh, nice. uh, yeah, so Japan is just not done yet. And this race is actually going to be huge for him. And, um, but they, they need. I think they need even a better race than this one to win. This ball club dodging there was the key to that race. Uh, if he uh, didn't dodge, then up that though it was GG. And yeah. oh my goodness, we are going to SNES Rainbow Road, which is Japan's best track. One of Japan's best tracks, and um, late right now, I'm not sure what's the read right now, but uh, Japan needs a nearly uh, like nearly. Uh, the same race they just had on Airship Fortress, uh, but re replicating this one. Uh, shocks are not that common here, but um, they can happen. Like USA is getting all the shocks every time, so it could really easily happen. And uh, last race, last shot for Japan. They need to win this race by a high amount, or else USA is going to be your champions. Uh, so let's see what happens. Like right now, top early top, uh, yeah. top for Japan. I Super is drafting up right now, and uh, mm. we're getting into third. This is going to be actually good because he could pull reds right here. Uh, and Dena, but hearts are actually very good as well. It gives protection, so he does yeah, will stay in the top spot. No, he didn't. Yeah, so still a top two for um for Japan. Actually, trying to get this trail off. Oh, he, did he get it? it? He did. He did. Oh my goodness! We were doing a really good job staying up there. And oh, this blooper is gonna be really, really unfortunate for him. He's not gonna have that much pressure. He might get side redded or side green, or get hit by the slide. Anything. Oh, he has to play aggressive here. Yeah. Oh my goodness. He gets the red off. Oh my god. And this is a top two. This is top two. This might be it. This might Wait, though, the shock from Japan, though. Oh, the shock from Japan, actually. Is that baseball? Yeah, it's baseball club dodges. But it's two dodges. Two dodges as well. Oh, he's all over the Oh my goodness. No. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't think it's enough. I actually don't know if it's enough. That three, two three is really close, but that bottom two, I think it might be enough for USA to take it. Plus two for USA. Mm. All right. Bottom two. I don't know. I don't hear that. Nope. It's not call. enough. It's not enough. It's a minus five for USA. Two thirty-seven mm. to two thirty-one. The United States of America are your Mario Kart Tour world champions. I'm speechless. Wow. Oh my god. It wasn't USA even a 2 1, it. it was a 2 0. USA has done it, and they 2 0 Japan over there. Let's go. Oh my god. Just amazing stuff from them. Just, I, I. I'm actually so happy for them. I, I might don't, I might not seem so happy for them, but I'm actually really happy for them. Like, of course, I'm not a uh, USA member, so uh, like, I'm, I'm not like, yeah, pop up, great, congrats. But that's some great, great, great performance for the USA. That, as, uh, oh my like, yeah, th these guys the end have done. Dude, I mean, the ending is insane. 
It's ending, yeah, it's ending. Oh my goodness, Baseball Club dodging Race 11, and then that ending play for Super, where they, I think they, uh, Japan pulls a shot, Super FX6 uh, uh, squish, but then Samuel the Bagger clutching the second place along with Speedy 2 3. Clutches that. Oh my goodness, bro. I, I, I'm. Wow. There's a lot to unpack last race, or those last three races, and that top top three five as well to set it up. Oh my goodness. No, the 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 race, the race that changed everything was that top circuit race, forever going into the memory of USA fans as the race that gave them the victory. Not like, even just USA fans, Mario Kart fans in general. That was yeah. a legendary race from the United States, right there. Yeah, for sure, I, 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 I'm here to like discuss what happened uh, right now with uh, my friends uh, on SK. But um, right now, USA has just did the unthinkable for uh, many of the people. But uh, that like it was actually really close. Like both teams were really close, and uh, what like this could really easily happen and could happen last week. And can happen uh, next tournament. Like this game, of uh, of all three games, I think this game is actually the most uh, uh, likely to have this kind of upsets because the skill level between uh, the top teams is really close and it's getting closer with every time. Like there's no real difference. Uh, unlike like for example, just some insane players. For example, on four baseball clubs will be doing the difference, but it's real like. Every single of the every one of these players is just so skilled uh, at this game, and the skill gap is really close. So uh, things that did, like this can could happen. Like France could have won United States last week. Uh, Mexico could have done it too. Uh, but right now it is what it is, and USA just done it. Uh, just did it. Sorry, and um, they absolutely did it. Just huge congrats for them. Huge congrats to all the USA team. All the preparation they did paid off at the end, and. I'm so happy for them. This is like we we saw Japan falling at the end, uh, the great favorites, and I don't know. Maybe we will be seeing this exact uh, same result in other game. I I'm not sure. Maybe yeah, MKV USA USA North just played Japan and MKV. Unfortunately, they did get knocked out by France in Mario Kart 8. <laughs> but um, you know, very very uh, very very good. And honestly. I think probably one of the best world, one of the best tournaments, honestly, for the Mario for Mario Kart Tour. I mean, the prestige is insane. We saw a lot of good, cool, really big upsets like Ecuador, um, Ecuador and uh, Costa Rica making it to the top eight, and uh, Mexico just barely, barely losing to uh, Japan just because of a blue shell. And of course, the United States, which I think a lot of people going to turn were not really high on them, but as they, you know, as the tournament grew on. They became the uh, tournament favorites, and um, yeah, I believe, you... yeah, I believe we're gonna try to get actually an interview with uh, the USA team. Um, but yeah, I believe, uh, yeah, we will be doing an interview shortly. But uh, bro, this has been such a fun tournament, Sanch. I know you've participated in it. It's been fun just following it and organizing it. I think yeah. as well. It, this tournament has just been insane like i i had so much fun playing and casting all these matches and um yeah so like i just have thanked like er every single one of the stamp members of uh that made this thing possible and just uh amazing stuff from all of them like this tournament has just been the one of the greatest uh, ever events uh happening on the mkt community uh only on the mkt community but uh as well as MKW and MKE8, just uh, one of the best things I have seen so far. I am having so much fun uh, watching all three games, and um, yep. yeah, especially this one because uh, this one I, I, I wouldn't say. I mean, that we, we love this game. There's a reason why we love this, this game. I mean, I, I know. <laughs> I, I know Mario Kart Tour gets a really bad rep because it is the mobile game and it's kind of considered gotcha game. But the competitive side, I, I honestly personally thought that the it's like a mobile cash grab, but the the competitive side has been super interesting for me and i've had such a fun time over the past year learning and understanding this game and getting to know the community honestly one of the best communities i've been a part of in a very like ever honestly very everyone's very very nice very very wholesome there's like very little not too much like you know dramatic drama everyone's really friendly to each other like i it's weird for me, like as a new player, like I could talk to Sanch, which is like really kind of, it's not that, it's, you don't really see that with like 
Mario Kart 8 or like Mario Kart Wii or, or other competitive games in general. I'm not even talking about just Mario Kart, but any competitive games. Like I could be like a newbie just talking to Sanji, like, hey, how can I get better? How can I do this? And honestly, if you ever want to get into it, this is a very good tour to get into it. Um, and I, the community is very, very uh, willing to accept new members and very, very willing to uh, teach uh, teach people as uh, we do have a lot of the United States people trickling in to the stuff. We will get started in the interview very shortly, just waiting on, I think, um, I believe two more USA members. But yeah, um, again, thank you to Endgame TV again for hosting this. Thank you for to the, um, I do want to give a shout out to the uh, MKT staff, uh, Mitch, uh, Vantox, uh, Trash, uh, Critical, um, Kazuo, um, for being stuff, uh, for uh, helping organize this as well. And I believe we do have all of the United States here, I think, as well. Yeah, but again, uh, we will be starting this interview. Um, we have Team USA here. Say hello, guys. Hello. 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 Hey, hello. hey, hey. Hello. Um, again, first off, congratulations. Thank Going you. into the tournament, I think a lot of people were like, kind of considering you like maybe like a lower tier team like not like the top team but like a very high tier team but it's been proved time and time and again with you know very dramatic results especially against france and now japan um what was your mindset going into this or i mean mitch super effects i know we mentioned this in the interview but uh what was your uh what was the selection process of the roster and who did you really want to uh who did you really want to build this world cup winning roster yeah, so I guess I can speak. So, um, honestly, when we built our roster, it was not more about um, if the players were good, but rather um, if the players had motivation to improve. And more so, what I believe the reason why we were successful about that is because by um, improving in that way, where like where we start off weaker, but then build up to be stronger, you add, you end up building more synergy at that. And with Mario Kart Tour especially. Um, if you have somebody who's very, very motivated to improve, if you just give them the right materials, uh, they would be able to improve drastically and end up being at a high division level. So, for example, uh, three people in our uh, roster, specifically was Comtrues, uh, NH Speedy, and Jimmy. All three of them, uh, actually, when we selected them, they were only in Division 4 of the Clan War League. However, I saw potential in these people, especially because all three of them have very high synergy with them. They've pretty much always been playing with each other and I saw it specifically their mindset as well is that they were very motivated to improve and they had a great mindset in the sense of they didn't blame the game for stuff they more so they thought instead of let's just say something bad happens they're like uh, instead normally people would be like oh this game is bad and like unlucky instead they're like well how could we improve and when you have that type of mindset improvement just comes in handy it just comes in, in that way so, yeah, and I think that's honestly our strength at that. Yeah, very very good answer. Um, I know that you, I know that you probably there's a lot of mo like motivation rather than raw skill at the beginning, and I think that really did help as the uh, tournament did like come together. Yeah, I've noticed you guys uh did a lot of VOD, especially VOD reviews, which I don't think yeah. a lot of teams do uh, at this level. Um, or anything for Mario Kart Tour, but uh, you guys were very, very dedicated. Um, I guess my second question is, uh, you guys had a very interesting strategy or going into Japan. I know that um, you guys have, um, in scrims, you guys have tested the strategy out. Can you, is it possible that you can explain it? Like, just kind of, what's, what was your like approach to facing this very, very strong Japan team? Yeah, so, a lot of so normally when people think of the MKT meta, they think of they're gonna have one person just be the dedicated bagger. Um, but here's the issue: is that you're gonna have that one person be the dedicated bagger with the shock glider, but no one else has the shock glider, right? So there will, there could be a situation where, like, let's say it's like four v four, and then only one person in on one team bags. That means it's a four v three, where like everyone else is at the top. And let's just say uh, the team who's bagging, one of them gets hit. That means uh, you have bottom two, which is like seventh and eighth place, where eighth place has the shock letter, but seventh place doesn't have the shock letter. So as a result, eighth place is going to be staying behind and basically never catch up. Um, 
We actually have a strategy where instead of opting one person to go shock later, we opt, we opt to have everyone go shock later. That way we actually have a lot of mobility um, where let's just say one person gets hit and the bagger, like, so in our lineups, we've actually had Samuel be our dedicated bagger. Um, he's had a lot of experience with it and it definitely shows with the World Cup matches. We would always have him start an eighth and just stay an eighth and catch up at the very end. But let's just say um, the other team does not decide to bag then there could be a situation where one of us gets hit and that means Samuel passes us. Now normally if there's a situation where the team only has one shock lighter, then that backer has to keep staying in eighth. But instead we could just quickly switch and say, okay, now we're gonna have the person in eighth be our bagger. And in that way, we're actually not staying far behind and we actually can still catch up at the very end and still have a lot of mobility in that sense. Yeah, and I actually noticed the oh, sorry to interrupt. Yeah, no, 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 I don't worry, go ahead. Yeah, I actually noticed that in the Alone the Thrace on DS on Airship Fortress that uh, you actually pulled the shock uh, and not Samuel, and Samuel was able to get up there and yeah. uh, you know clutch it up. Yeah, for sure. That's exactly that. That honestly pays off in itself because let's just, like if I didn't have the shock lighter, then chances are I probably wouldn't have pulled the shock. So in that sense that type of strategy actually pays off really well and also a lot of people they think of if they use the shock litter that it hinders the probability of like pulling red shells or, or mushrooms it actually doesn't in that sense because usually second place always pulls red shells third place always pulls shrooms and first place usually pulls coins bananas and green shells if you use like a red shell glider you'll pull more red shells but you basically cannot pull the shock but if you use the shock glider you can pretty much almost guaranteed pull the shock at least once if not it's pretty unlucky that it doesn't happen at that so that's why we all opt to shock later because at the very least we have mobility in that sense and we're not altering the item probabilities all right uh, i think that was Sanj talking no it wasn't <laughs> <laughs> I, I, want to ask mute him. I want to ask something yes, really oh yeah go ahead yeah, go ahead. Yeah, um, after that, you, you already won, like, the World Cup, but, um, like, what are you, like, I, I, I'm surely uh, seeing, like, most of your, uh, most of USA roster going to a uh, high Division I uh, teams uh, into Clan World League. Like, what is your mental, like, what's your expectation after winning this World Cup going into a Clan World League tournament uh, next season? Division one. <laughs> well, first off, I mean, we'd we'd really like to play in Division One, but if there's a situation where we don't play, honestly, we're just here to have fun. Like, I think we've built up such a great friend group. Like, USA has not really turned into like a clan, but more so about about a friend group, and we're just here to have fun at that. Whether we win or whether we lose, we just we're just gonna vibe, and that's pretty much what we're going for. Although we'd love to win the Division One if we could. Um, of course, just stuff happens, and maybe one war you're very unlucky and no shocks happen. Uh, other wars you get super lucky. Either way, we're not uh, highly stressed out about that. We're honestly just here to have fun. So or a friendship. Yeah, the fr <laughs> yes, friendship prevails. The, the cliche, but it really shows. So yeah. Yeah, I mean, I was gonna mention the camaraderie, but you mentioned it perfectly. Um, do you have any other questions, Sanch? Yeah, no, uh, just say the power of friendship beats one baseball boy. <laughs> uh, oh uh, thank God. Uh, I mean, you guys won on the LA tour, so. Yeah, home know, field kind of advantage. I, field we've advantage. Said, we've said this two weeks, like, when the, the when the tour was announced, it's like, it's coming home. This was this was planned. Nintendo's on our side. We had <laughs> We had the baseball home field advantage. But, yeah, here's, here's, the, uh, here's the thing, though. It's like, it, it's 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 just funny at that sense like we obviously that wasn't an official strategy but we just thought it was really funny when it was the home field <laughs> um yeah i think that wraps it up for us um i just do want to say again thank you to the mkt staff and also turner staff um for organizing this thank you iric as well for being the head honcho for this uh being our lovely lovely stream host um for this final uh final best of uh final best of three and again also to sammy and calvin for doing a very good job and um 
just like organizing this and um i think that wraps it up for us uh do we does anyone have any last words uh i have i have none uh what about any of you all from uh the usa USA, USA, USA. <laughs> Join the MTC server. USA, USA. USA. <laughs> Hamburgers, <laughs> fries. Oh my. McDonald's. All right. <laughs> McDonald's. <laughs> yeah. McDonald's. All right. Um. All right, I think that's about it. I, I, yeah. Okay. <laughs> I, I think you guys are pretty happy. I'm gonna let you guys uh, go. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna let you guys uh, go go have fun in your VC. But um, thank you guys so much for uh, watching. And um, oh yes, before we go, um, if you guys want to see participate in not only just Mario Kart uh, Mario Kart Tour mat uh, Mario Kart Tour uh, competitive matches, but also Mario Kart uh, Eight Deluxe competitive matches, uh, go to MarioKartCentral.com and sign up. We have plenty of tournaments uh, from free for all to uh, Clan Wars and uh as, as, we, as some as, as Sam mentioned we do have a clan war league for uh kind of similar to like mario kart universal for uh mk tour it's very very fun very very stacked uh we're expecting i think around 10 divisions this upcoming uh this upcoming uh season so that's gonna be super hyped i hope you guys join us um and honestly i love them i love also join the mario kart uh Mario Kart uh, competitive, Mario Kart Tour competitive Discord as well. Um, very, very fun community. One of the most, one of the best communities I've ever joined. Everyone's super, super fun and wholesome there, and really, really nice. And um, lastly, uh, we do have. Uh, I think Ira can correct me on this, but we do have. I think MK Wii and MK Eight matches tomorrow uh, night. Uh, you can correct me if I'm wrong, uh, Ira, or not. But I believe we do have Mario Kart Wii, um, uh, Mario Kart Wii Japan versus US North on Saturday, July twenty fourth at uh, midnight Eastern. So it's gonna be very, very late, and um, we will have uh, Japan versus France um, sometime. I think before then, but uh, before then or after then, that match is still to be determined. But uh, yeah, um, thank you all for watching uh, from. Sanch, myself, and everyone from Endgame TV, uh, thank you for watching and have a lovely day and or night. Bye bye. Good night. See you. See you guys. <laughs>